This is your launch pad. But you don't want this standard look anymore, because you're special. You want this. Let's fix that. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to apply launchpad stickers and customize your own launchpad to look a little bit more like this. You can pick up a set of launchpad stickers from the first link in the description. There's tons of different types there if you want to spice things up a bit. Once your stickers actually arrive, get them out of the envelope and lay them out on the table. Look at them, they're beautiful, you must be so excited already. Once they're out, go and grab your launchpad as well. You, you do need that. It helps to clean off your launchpad a little bit before we start putting the stickers on. Obviously don't use any liquid cleaners, you still want your launchpad to actually work when we're finished with this. You might find that using a small cloth or an air duster might help you to get the buttons cleaner. Once your launchpad's looking all shiny again, go and grab your stickers. We'll start with the square buttons. Hold the sticker sheet like this and push down on opposite corners to release one of the stickers from your sticker sheet. Once you've got that, hold the sticker by the top edge and bring it over to the launchpad. Give it a quick wipe down again just before you apply the sticker, and then line the sticker up about a sixteenth of an inch away from the bottom edge, but also away from the side edges as well. Once that's in place, push the bottom edge down and make sure it lines up. If everything looks good, go and push down the rest of the sticker. That's it, there's one done. If you do mess this up though, you can just take the sticker off and have another go. But don't worry, under normal use these stickers won't come off unless you want them to. Now that you've got one of these, repeat this for the rest of the buttons as well. Just of course don't forget the centre buttons, they are slightly different. Once you're done, you might notice some bubbles under these buttons. And this happens because there's a slightly raised area on the actual button just underneath the sticker. This is there to help with tactility during some performances. If you like, you can cut these parts off with a knife, but be aware your launchpad will be permanently damaged after doing this, and won't look the same if you choose to take your stickers off. We'll move on to the circle buttons next. The idea is pretty much the same here. Take the sticker off the sheet, line it up with one of the edges, and then push down when you're happy with it. Then you need to repeat this for all the 32 edge buttons on a launchpad pro, or all the 16 edge buttons on any other launchpad. There, you're done! If you have any other questions though, you can reach out to me through the contact page on my website, or join our community Discord server to get some help there as well. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.